Hello there, here is a quick demo of the KPM Payroll module. We'll start off here on the dashboard which shows the list of clients. And one good feature of KPM's Payroll module is the bulk payroll automation settings. So if you have any clients on a fixed salary or a company full of directors, you can set the payroll to be run automatically through the software. You'll be able to fill in the required fields here and select recurring. You can also notify to after submission with employee payslips and sync the data with bookkeeping. So what this does, it creates a journal and then automatically puts it into bookkeeping for you. So you can set the payroll to be run automatically and you just have to do this manually for the first time. To actually set up the payroll, we can move back to the dashboard and select a client. Within Manage Payroll, you have employees. You can bring in unlimited employees and you can do this either manually by selecting the blue button and filling in the six steps or import employees using a CSV file, which is a three step process. Next, you have the additional section, which has the employee leaves, additions and deductions, attachments of earnings, mileage and expense claims. Next, you have the leave and holidays. This is purely an admin panel and you can track the entitled leaves. And you have the timekeeping. For employees paid hourly, you can add time records manually or using a CSV file. It's really handy for the above if you give client access and saves you time. Next, you have the process payroll. So to approve records, you simply select the checkbox. You can run the pension assessments and then run the payroll. Once you run the payroll, you can also submit the FPS here. If you need to submit the EPS, just move to submissions, select FPS and EPS and toggle to the EPS tab here. Next, you have the payslips. They're generated and you can view them here and you're able to also bulk send those payslips out here and select payslip styles. Next, you have HMRC Connect, so you can get tax codes with their credentials. There'll be a notification for changes within the year and then you just click apply. Moving on to auto enrollment. The client just needs to either put the staging date or re-enrollment date here. And you can move on to pension schemes. You can add schemes by selecting the blue button here and select the provider type. We have direct integration with Nest and Smart Pension. You'll be able to see the pension correspondence here and the pension service log for Nest and Smart Pension. So it gives the submission numbers and statuses. Along with the FPS in the submissions, we have the year end amendment FPS to make any changes to payroll at the end of that current period. And then the earlier year update for two years and before. We also have unlimited P11D forms that you can generate here and submit them straight to HMRC here. Next, you have the payroll journals. So if you have a client that's using another software for bookkeeping, you'll be able to export those journals out by selecting the blue button to the current modes of export shown. You also have the reports where you'll be able to see the payroll summary, the periodic tax and NI, where you can see the total amount payable to HMRC. And then within the additional forms, you'll find the P45 and the P60. You also have the departmental and tax code reports at the bottom here. And that is KPM's payroll module. Thank you so much for watching.